Is rolling? Yeah. <laughs> uh, some recruiting. I mean, I can't really describe it. I mean, it's just a blessing to be recognized by as many schools as I'm being recognized by. Uh, I mean, it's big for me. I know uh, many athletes, they wish that, you know, one of their parents could come to the games. And unfortunately, you know, they can't. But he's at all of my games. Uh, he's my biggest supporter and my biggest critic, and that's what I feel like has helped me get like this far because I feel like I can take criticism from anybody and it it just doesn't hurt me, it doesn't faze me. The new team at Moravia. <laughs> uh, I'm just ready to get get to school, work with the guys. Uh, you know, we got a big addition that just uh, announced that he was going to come to Moravia, which I know Shaq. Uh, black and then we got we got many players that you know people are sleeping on uh, Yeah My season expectations are to you know take my game to another level uh, Last year was my first real year being in the weight room and getting accustomed to it now this year I'm hit the weights a whole lot harder uh, And I know what it takes to you know Like train like a pro and work like a pro and that's the type of approach that I want to take coming into next season. And then I want to, most of the younger guys and everybody on the team, really, I just want them to, you know, like look at me as a leader. And I feel like the team, we can accomplish some great things if we put put in hard work, you know, everybody writing about us. Uh, what is Mervyn gonna do? I mean, all that looks good on paper, but we, at the end of the day, we got to go out there and perform. Uh, I've grown a lot. Uh, I mean, like, to like to this day, I look back at like what I used to do. Like when I was younger, I used to just be like a spot up shooter, really. And then, you know, I feel like I can put the ball on the floor. Uh, I'm more active in the game, you know. Uh, and I really like. I, I used to take plays off, and you know, I didn't really play with like a, a lot of emotion. Now, I feel like, yeah, I, I've gotten better with all that stuff. And I'm gonna keep on getting better with all that stuff too. <laughs> uh, we want to play everybody, everybody. Um, um, yeah. That's all I'm gonna say. We want to play everybody. Growing up, five was always fun for me. Um, when I first moved here from Texas, Josh was one of the Josh was one of my first friends, and now I consider him as one of my brothers. Um, we always had a good time together. Shoot, I don't know. I just can say a lot about that. Uh, growing up with Josh was always cool. Like, we didn't really get cool till like maybe two or three years ago. Cause like, I didn't. I ain't gonna lie. I ain't even like this man. Like, no cap. <laughs> I always thought he was a little cocky, you know. He was, you know, he always had the fame, the fortune, like that. But <laughs> hey, cuz you look, you know how this, bro. You, Come on, chill, 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 yeah, but mm -hmm. the <laughs> like that, cuz like you know, they, they used to, you know, my life, cuz you know, they used to, you feel me? He, he was always highly praised, so you know, like, I was like, you know, he, he, he big time, like, but yeah, <laughs> then we got cool, and like, it was like, it was only up from there, like, and it's been straight good vibes. Great Ever since then, great vibes. <laughs> when Josh started blowing up and stuff, he ain't changed on us. Um, he was always around. He was always around. Um, what else can I say? Gang, gang, yeah, all that, all that. Like my brother said, you know, it's like a lot of people from Durham, like when they start to blow up, they start to get offers and, you know, Getting a spotlight, they kind of like shy away from the city and they kind of leave and don't come back at Hollywood And he never really did that and that's like one of the main reasons why like, I respect him so much like as a man because he never gave up on the city <laughs> Cause he, you feel me? He, just, he still putting the city on the map and as a player uh, I remember when 
Like, we was real little. Like he said, he was just a straight shooter. Then he got taller and taller. And man, was six four. We like, Josh, bro, you should be dunking now. Couldn't even dunk the basketball. Could not dunk the basketball. For nothing. <laughs> you feel me? So, and then like, just watching him like transition his game from just being like a pure shooter to now slashing and just being a point forward. It's just amazing, like, it's going from kids to like, now just watching him grow, it just, it's crazy. It's crazy. I'm about to go to Capital BST and get some shoes. We ain't in Durham with it right now, we in Raleigh. I ain't even gonna speak too much about Raleigh. We just know Durham the best, best city in the state of North Carolina. This, this my, this my best friend right here. Please forgive her. You, you might look up and find some over here. <laughs> no, bro. <laughs> you come on, bro. You asked for it, bro. You asked for it, bro. Hey, bro. Hit my call. <laughs> Today we uh get, get, get. woke up at like seven. Check my phone. I have no notifications at all, man. <laughs> None, man. So we're about to sleep. You feel me? You feel me? Woke up. They was gone. They left me at the crib. Like. <laughs> It's cool though, it's cool, it's cool, over it's cool, you feel me? They left me at the crib. And then, you texting me, I'm like, I bet my, my man Matt's about to pull up, you feel me? He, you pulled up, we got in the whip, we went home, we went to my crib. We went to my crib, and when we went to my crib, you feel me, you brought the lights out. You brought the lights out. <laughs> gotta check. Gotta check up the fire just to make sure they see that. You feel me? Uh, we did. You asked me questions. Yeah. I answer the questions, you ask them questions, they answer the questions. Yeah. And then we slid. Hey, hey. We know. Oh, you can't touch this. Hey, we try to reach shit. Okay. We uh and then we went to Capital BST, you feel me? Picked up some shoes. You feel me? Picked up some shoes. Picked up some kicks. You feel me? Yeah. And then we had to slide by to see my man's Sir Castle Tees. Slid me some ones. He about to, he about to fix them up. You feel me? He always do a good job fixing them up. Fixing them up. Fixing them up. You feel me? I'm going to fix them up. And then we went to Crabtree. Went to Crabtree. You feel me? We was kicking it, chilling. Got some good grub. Uh, by the way, just let y'all know, Highway 55 don't sell no more wings, man. We got that, we so sad, man. I really wanted some wings. Shout out to the waiter if she ever see this, you feel me? The waitress, I mean. Shout out to the waitress if she ever see this. She was really cool, you feel me? Yeah. That's, that's confidential information, you feel me? And then we came to South Point. We're here at South Point right now. 
and we're about to go. We're about to leave. Oh yeah, I got some jeans. 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 This is Josh Hall. And this is Dana Life Part 2. Without the hoop. Tell me I'm garbage, I'm going through something, that's why I ain't calling. Phone and progression, it's all that I wanted. The phone and affection, I summon and dub it. Cause check out problems on problems on problems on problems on problems. I solve them, I run through the money, the pressure be calling.